Milo, which is a new computer chip from Google that they just uh, they just um, tested with the new quantum computer. In a groundbreaking revelation that has sent shockwaves through the scientific community, Google's quantum chip has made an extraordinary discovery, potentially unlocking access to parallel universes. Yes, you heard that right. Once confined to the realm of theoretical physics, the concept of parallel universes might now be more than mere speculation, all thanks to advancements in quantum computing. This is no longer just science fiction. It's a reality that has left experts both fascinated and deeply unsettled. But how did a quantum chip manage to breach the barrier between universes? And why are scientists so concerned about its implications? These questions have ignited fierce debate, leaving many to ponder what this could mean for the future of quantum computing, physics, and even our understanding of reality itself. Before we get into the details, let's first take a step back and understand the basics of quantum computing and what makes this discovery so extraordinary. Quantum computers are different from traditional computers in fundamental ways. While conventional computers process information in binary form using bits that are either one or zero, quantum computers leverage the strange properties of quantum mechanics to process information in quantum bits or qubits. Unlike regular bits, qubits can exist in a superposition of states, meaning they can be both one and zero at the same time. This gives quantum computers the ability to solve incredibly complex problems at speeds that traditional computers can't even begin to match. Quantum computers also exploit another phenomenon known as entanglement, where two qubits become linked together in such a way that the state of one qubit directly affects the state of the other, no matter how far apart they are. This allows for the kind of parallelism and processing power that could revolutionize industries ranging from artificial intelligence to cryptography to drug discovery. It is this intricate nature grounded in quantum mechanics that has given rise to the unexpected. As scientists push the boundaries of quantum computing, some are beginning to wonder if these systems operate beyond the confines of our universe, potentially accessing alternate realities. The implications are so profound that some fear we may have just opened Pandora's box. Now, let's talk about Google's latest development. Google has been at the forefront of quantum computing for years with their quantum computing lab, known as the Google Quantum AI Lab, making significant strides in developing functional quantum chips. One of their most notable achievements was in 2019 when Google claimed to have achieved quantum supremacy. The moment when a quantum computer solved a problem that would have been practically impossible for even the most powerful supercomputers to solve. At the heart of this achievement was their Sycamore processor, a 54-qubit quantum chip. It was a landmark moment for quantum computing because it demonstrated that quantum computers could outperform classical computers in specific tasks. But now, Google has taken things to an entirely new level with their latest quantum chip which scientists believe has quite literally tapped into parallel universes. How did this happen? The breakthrough emerged when Google's quantum engineers were testing the Sycamore processor to assess its capabilities. As part of an experiment analyzing qubit interactions within a quantum system, they noticed something unexpected. While qubits typically communicate through quantum entanglement, Researchers observed unusual behavior as the qubits interacted during the test. The patterns they created weren't consistent with the behavior of any known system within our universe. Instead, it seemed like the qubits were tapping into information from other unknown sources, potentially from parallel universes. To explain this in simpler terms, imagine you're trying to connect to a network of computers. You expect to communicate with machines that are all part of the same system. But what if, while attempting to make your connection, you suddenly receive data from computers that aren't even part of the system you're connected to? That's essentially what happened during Google's quantum experiment. The qubits seem to be pulling information from other realities that were not part of our known universe. This revelation has sparked speculation that Google's quantum chip could be accessing dimensions beyond our own. These dimensions may correspond to parallel universes, each governed by its own distinct physical laws and constants. For decades, 
physicists have theorized about the possibility of quantum systems interacting with these alternate dimensions, but it remained purely hypothetical. Until now, Google's quantum chip seems to provide the first tangible evidence that these dimensions could be real. Now you might be wondering, why is this so concerning for scientists? After all, tapping into parallel universes sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie. But shouldn't it be exciting? And it is, to some extent. But it's also deeply worrying because of the potential risks it poses, not just to the scientific community, but to the stability of reality itself. One of the key concerns is that once we start interacting with parallel universes, we may not fully understand the consequences. Right now, scientists have no way of predicting how these parallel realities might influence our own. Could interacting with these universes cause disruptions in our own reality? What happens if we accidentally bring something from a parallel universe into our world? Could it be dangerous? Could it unravel the very fabric of our universe? These questions are troubling enough to make even the most seasoned quantum physicists uneasy. The idea of parallel universes has been a topic of debate for years. But with advancements in technology potentially granting us access to them, new existential dilemmas emerge. It's like stepping through a doorway without knowing what awaits on the other side. The sheer power of quantum computing could make it nearly impossible to close that door once it has been opened. Furthermore, the unpredictable nature of quantum systems only amplifies these concerns. By its very nature, quantum mechanics is chaotic and uncertain making it incredibly difficult to regulate interactions between our universe and any parallel ones we might encounter. In such an unstable framework, even the slightest disturbance in one universe could have catastrophic repercussions in another, including our own. But it's not just the unknown effects of these interactions that have scientists worried. There are also the ethical implications of being able to tap into parallel universes. Imagine a future where we have the ability to access an infinite number of realities. What happens when the lines between them begin to blur? Who controls the access to these parallel worlds? What happens if we start altering events in other universes? Could our actions in one universe cause irreversible damage to another? These are ethical dilemmas that are too big to ignore. Some have raised the possibility that the quantum chip's ability to access parallel universes could even have far-reaching consequences beyond science, like the potential to impact the course of human history itself. What if we could gain access to knowledge or technology from other universes? If alternate realities have developed along divergent paths, could our choices significantly alter the future of our own world? The power to shape entire realities is both thrilling and unsettling. Yet, the most concerning question remains. Could our progress in quantum computing trigger unforeseen consequences on a massive scale? Could Google's quantum chip be just the beginning of a technological revolution we're not prepared for? As quantum computers grow more powerful, they may allow us to manipulate reality itself, potentially unleashing risks we won't fully grasp until it's too late. This concern is heightened by the fact that not everyone agrees on how quantum technology should be used to explore parallel universes. While some scientists are eager to push the boundaries, others urge caution. Many argue that the risks far outweigh the potential benefits and warn that we might be treading into perilous territory, experimenting with forces beyond our comprehension. Manipulating alternate dimensions holds both potential and risk. It could lead to revolutionary discoveries that reshape human history, yet it might also introduce threats beyond our ability to control. The ethical, philosophical, and practical consequences of exploring parallel universes are so profound that they could permanently alter our perception of science and the future of technology. Every decision made leads to the creation of a parallel universe to accommodate each possible outcome. Take a simple quantum event, for example whether a particle exists in one state or another. According to the Many Worlds interpretation, both possibilities occur, but in separate universes. One universe forms where the particle is in state A, while another emerges where it's in state B. This means that with every quantum event, 
a new universe branches off, leading to an ever-expanding multiverse. But what does this have to do with Google's quantum chip? Quantum computers operate on principles closely tied to the many worlds interpretation.